Hey Trade Zero fam, Adam here. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to set up a hotkey, all right? Please note that in this video, we will be using a Mac showcasing a live demo account for Zero Pro while running Parallels Virtual Machine. We do not recommend that you use a virtual emulator when live trading. So with that said, let's jump right into it. Once you have your Zero Pro platform open, right? You wanna select hotkeys, okay? So once you select hotkeys, you're gonna see this hotkey configuration window populate, all right? Right in the top left corner, you're gonna see action. From here, we wanna select this drop down, and then we wanna go on ahead and create a set up or send order hotkey, all right? That's the focus for today. So on the side, I'm just gonna create a buy order, but you see some other options there. For quantity type, I'm gonna choose shares. Quantity, I'm just gonna set it to default of 100 shares. For my order type, I'm going to select a limit order, all right? And then for route, I'm going to select sim. Be very aware of this route section. If you're on a live account, you're gonna see smart. I'm on a demo account, so it says sim for simulator. So for time and force, I'm just gonna go on ahead and select day, since right now we're in between the pre-market and the close, 4 p.m., so 4 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern time. That's when the time and force is available for use, all right? You wanna make sure that you're selecting the right one, otherwise you may get a rejection order, okay? So for price source, the next thing I'm gonna select is the asking price. All right, I want to create a buy order on the ask. And then for price offset, what I'm going to do is do a negative spot zero five cent order. And what that's going to do is it's going to create an order to be below the ask by five cents. OK, so now that we have that set up, I want to create a keyboard shortcut. Today, I'm just going to select control B and that's going to give me my designated hotkey. So now that that's created, what I want to do is select auto send order so that way it can push the order out right away. Please be aware that when you're in a live trade and you have auto send order selected, you won't get a pop-up confirmation to confirm whether or not you want to place the order. The whole purpose of using hotkeys is to enter trades faster, but please note that your order will execute when auto send order is selected. We'll cover risk management and stop losses in another video. So now we go on ahead and click apply, hit close, and now we can go on ahead and execute our order with the hotkey, okay? So for Apple, I have that selected. Make sure you have the level two selected in which you're gonna create the order from. That's a very important point. So I'm gonna hit control B for my hotkey, and now we can see that my order here is now pending. So there we are. That's how you create a hotkey. And that's it, it's as simple as that. Look out for more of these Zero Pro tricks and tips.